I've seen those thieves driving away in my car! Send somebody to catch them! Where did this happen? In the middle of the street! While I was standing at a red light, he just dragged me out of my car and drove away! <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't be laughing, but the, the imagery of that. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to 911 Operator, the pre release. That is correct, guys. The game is finally done. This will be hitting Steam on the 24th, so all the information down below in the description will tell you how to pick this up for yourself if you've been eyeing it as well. If you remember, we actually covered this in the pre-alpha stage, alpha stage, beta stage, and right now I have the full release. Well, technically it's the pre-release, but you know, it comes out in two days, so uh, this is technically the full release. And everything is done. The career is done. It's been balanced. There's actually progression now, so I'm actually quite excited to see how the final game is going to look like here for us. Now, if you enjoyed this, let me know in the comments, let me know by leaving a like, because I'll check out the career mode, and if you guys enjoyed, I might start doing a little bit of a free game where I check out your cities and your suggestions. So, if you want to see some more, let me know, and also, if you want me to try out your city, or whatever, let me know in the comments, hey, Falcon, this is my city, check it out, and we might do a free game on a couple of chosen cities here in the future. So again, let me know in the comments how you feel about this, let's get into the game here, we're going to career. Um, now, for career, you do have to start off in Kapolei which is a, a Hawaiian city, situated on the island of Oau. Oau, Oau, Oi, Oa, Ching, Chang, Badaram, Bang, Bang. Very close to Pearl City. And we have a population here of 15,000. And in order to go on to the next one, we have to get a reputation of 100, which doesn't seem really too much, honestly. So, um, this version of the map is outdated. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and update it, my friend. Alrighty, so here we go. This will be our dudes to start off with. Let's see, we get we start off with three police squads, we have three paramedics, and we have two fire trucks. And we actually have a fire truck over here hanging out in the back, it does seem. No equipment, one extra vehicle, and we have two extra staff members, a police officer, and a medic. How much money do I have to start off with? 10,000, huh? Huh, huh, huh. Well, I could, I could add you to an existing party, or I could probably... How much do you cost? 50,000. Oh, yeah, we probably won't be able to buy another vehicle. What about staff, though? We might be able to fill up our spots here, which I don't think is a bad idea. So, let's do... Let's pick up... Oh my god, that's a name that I won't be able to pronounce, man! What, what is this? Wojic... Wojic Godluski? I'm gonna call you God. Let's pick up God over here. And I'm gonna add you maybe over here, along with... Owen Martin, it feels like. So you... Do I just drag you? It's just dragon, right? Yeah, it's dragon. Okay, so you over here. Um, so police officers, check. One more paramedic, we just go ahead and add Brayden Paris over here, and we need maybe two more, and we could actually get four more um, firefighters as well. So let's come down here to medics, and we're looking for driving 85, first aid 95. Ah, uh, you're driving 56, and you're driving 73. Not really the best drivers out here, are you? You guys should be better driving. 97, that's actually really good driving 70. Um, can I get a really good driver? You're 85, which is, you know, good. Eh, good enough. Better than me. What would my driving rating be, you're asking? A zero. A fat zero. Uh, let me pick up Gavin Flores, and we need two more at least, right? Driving. Let's go with a high first aid one. I guess 72 is the highest one. So, you get, get, get out of here, you terrible driver. We'll add Gavin Flores here, and then we could do first aid 91. What's your first aid like? Uh, uh, whatever. Let's just go. Bam. Bam. I'm not gonna get any equipment just yet. The cops have a couple of... Actually, we should probably give... Yeah, we should probably pick up equipment for my cops over here. Bulletproof vest could be pretty useful. But I'll just do guns, guns, and... Boom. And... Boom. We got 2,000 left over. Um, it is enough for maybe a bulletproof vest. And maybe even one more firefighter. But you know what? Let's just roll it this way here. Can I... No. Okay. Start deployment. So... Um, in case you're unfamiliar, we will be answering a bunch of actual emergency calls. Not like literally, literally actual ones that are happening in real life, but the game takes a lot of audio from pre-existing stuff and records and actually uses it over here. And they also have added a bunch of new calls themselves. So I'm really excited to see what all is new here. So we have a fire station up here. We have a medical station here and a police station here. On occasion, our people have to go back to kind of like, you know, refuel recover and stuff like that, and also drop off people at the hospital they pick up, and, you know, people that are arrested at the police station, etc, etc. So, let's see. My units are over here, let's go ahead and spread this out here a little teeny tiny bit, so we'll do like maybe you here, um, you somewhere over here, and then my extra one, eh, I would say like somewhere over here, spread it out a little bit, and then you could kind of hang out here, 
And you, up here there's a lot of like curves up here, so this will be like a really terrible driving condition. And then we'll take at least one fire truck down here. Hmm, maybe move you here. That's pretty good. What do you guys think? Pretty good? Let's start our duty. Units go away, and we have our first call here. A car bump. Okay, so we'll go ahead and send you to check that one out if you don't mind. Alrighty, I'll try to keep the police operator dialogue inside in the game too. I'll have to like mess around with the levels and post editing, but you know, that's my own problem, don't you worry. You guys should be able to hear the operators when they come in though. Uh, and we can indeed speed up time over here, which we will. Can I pause on the fly? Uh, I have to click. There's really no shortcut for pausing? I hate it when games don't give me shortcuts for pausing. Okay, well whatever, I'll have to click up here. We have a new call though. 911, what's your emergency? Hello, I would like to order a baked pepperoni with extra cheese, please. Now this one right here is one that you guys told me, Falcon, that is actually a real call. Excuse me? You've reached 911. Yes, I know. Oh, and two cans of soda. You saw? That's the hint. She knows. Ma'am, do you have an emergency? Yes, I do. That's her hint. Hang up on her! Oh, come on, don't do that. And you can't talk because it's... yeah, that's the one. And you can't talk about it because of someone in the room? Yes, exactly. Boom. Do you also need medical attention? Is somebody hurt? Yes. Do you know how long it will be? So we need to send two things. I have an officer about a mile away. I'll, I'll send it right away. Yes, please. Can you stay on the line with me? No, thanks. I hope we'll get here soon. All right, the officers are coming. I copy. Going there. All right. Wow. Scary call. So, um, that's out of the way here. Now, out of curiosity, let's see, undercover pizza? We're headed there, we're headed there, don't you worry. So, that's done, let's come over to new incident, and we have fire call, luckily it's here. Now, uh, she mentioned also medical services, right, so let's send you over here just in case. We have a new incident somewhere else, down here. What is this one? We have a vehicle theft. Hey, you. Check that out. Did you carry- oh, you took care of that road bump or whatever, cool. Uh, on occasion, you gotta keep an ear out too because, um, your people will sometimes need, a uh, backup. Requesting support. Like so. So we need to send another vehicle, another cop up there. So let's send you over here to kind of give them a little bit of backup. We're under fire, need backup. Are you sure? Didn't you get that one already? Resolved. He's a drunk thug is what he is. New call? Alright, hold up, hold up. You, over here. New call. 911, what's your emergency? I want to report an illegally parked car. <laughs> Why does he sound like a fucking call operator? Is the car parked in a prohibited area? The car is blocking the traffic. <laughs> he doesn't sound like a human, man. Where's the car parked? It's a restricted area. Can you give me the address of where this car is parked, sir? I hope you will not regret that decision. Bye. Why does he sound like a robot? It's freaking me out. Alright, so we took care of that call. Good. Good job, guys. Um, here we need another emergency service. Let's see, you have one person. Um, you can, you might be able to pick them up before you dump off the other one, I think. And over here, let's see. For this one, I think we might need... I, I think we might need the... God damn it. We're, we're answering that one, right? For this one, I believe we're looking for... Would it be Firefighter, because they're blocking it just to the street? Let me send you over here just to be on the safe side. And you're no longer needed. Let's come over here and just give a little bit of backup, just in case. We spotted an epilepsy attack? Okay. Uh, careful with that. Um, what are you supposed to do with an epilepsy? You're supposed to hold them down, or is it a bad idea to hold them down? I never know. Like, apparently, I think you're supposed to hold them down because they could break their neck, but if you hold them down, it also breaks their neck. I don't know, man. Epilepsy's crazy stuff. Your body turning against you is what that is. Your body just turning against you. Alright, so here we go. We are waiting for the cops after all. Park car. So that one is police call. Oh, stop. Nine one one. What's your emergency? Hello, I need help. It's burning. 
Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. What's burning? I'm sorry, ma'am. What's burning? It's burning. Send in the fire brigade immediately, please. But where are you? Yeah, that one. Ma'am, where are you? Over here. Okay, I'm sending the fire department. Well, I'm waiting. Uh, <laughs> I like how she sounds very annoyed. Well, I'm waiting. Well, what we're gonna do it. Just relax. I'll send them over here. You're taking care of that one. New incident. Oh, Jesus, could you be any further away from everything else? All right, let's pick you up and you check that one out. Reputation's at 100 or 11. We're looking for 100. We've resolved six of them thus far. We made some pretty decent cash. I don't think we've missed anything thus far, right? We've been doing pretty good. How are you guys doing over here with this one? Resolved. Cool. Yeah, resolved and... Got him! Good job, guys. Good job. How are you doing over here? A couple of seconds? Okay. Not like over a minute, really. And this one, we're waiting for the fire brigade. New incident. Uh, that's the one you're taking care of. Alright, thus far, pretty good. Let's go faster here. Cool. Other things have been resolved. Should I move my people around though, just because I feel like they're very scrounged up in here? I think we probably should. You come back up here and take homeboy with you. And new incident. Five cops needed down here. Okay. You check this one out. Police intervention. One suspect possibly armed. Luckily, we did get everybody up and gun, so there's that. Nine one one. What's your emergency? My car was stolen. <laughs> Sounds very angry. I mean, I don't blame them. You would anybody would be angry for your car being stolen, but the first know thing. My car is? I know. No, I don't know where it's at, dude. When did it Who happen? Your car stolen. Just now. I've seen those thieves driving away in my car. Send somebody to catch them. <laughs> where did this happen? In the middle of the street. While I was standing at a red light, he just dragged me out of my car and drove away. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't be laughing, but the the imagery of that. What's the address of where this happened, sir? It happened at... Oh my god, that's really far. Okay, I'm gonna need your license plate. Can you give that to me, please? It's... What color is your car? Purple. What type of car is it? It was a van. He's a pimp! He's a pimp with a purple van! So how many suspects did you see? There were two of them. We're notifying the officers in the area now. They'll see if they can find your car. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> it's a purple pimp van, that's what that is. You spotted a heart attack? I hope you're taking care of that heart attack because I sent you over there for a reason. Right? You are doing it, correct? You should be. I copy, going there. Did you get it? You're working on it. Okay. Um, so this guy's over here on the move. I keep hitting him spacebar to pause because I'm so accustomed to games pause when you hit spacebar. Um, so over here, this is the one with the, the van, right? We are ready. Handle it. You go handle that. Um, we need police assistance over here. Any reason why we didn't pick that one up? We are ready. 10 4. Down here. What are the orders? 10 4. Police assistance over there. Okay. Nobody's under fire anymore. Go away, you, you keep bothering me thinking somebody's over here in trouble. Okay, so that one's done. These are the current incidents that we're kind of working on here. Caller. We're heading on that one. Okay, fast forward. Shots fired. Requesting backup. Oh, no! You're under fire? What are the orders? What's it looking like? Uh, you guys are definitely hurting here. Heavily injured, heavily injured. So... Man, I don't think we have anybody available here. You're dropping people off, right? So after you're done dropping people off, we might need a... As a matter of fact, just go there now if you can. I copy. Going there. And since you guys are injured, don't we have... Affirmative. Yeah. Send some paramedics as well. Okay, so over here... Heading over there. That one. Take care of that one. Wait around. Small car fire. We're just waiting for the cops now. And heart attack over here. Uh, you are taking care of this, right? Like, it feels like... Heading over there. Who did I just call? No, no, not you. We are ready. 10-4. You over there. I'm listening. Understood. I think you're, like, blocking the way <laughs> that I need to actually get there for some reason. Waiting for instructions. Heading over there. 
You should be coming over there. You're going up there. You're going on that one. Okay. I think we're fine other than this guy just being in the way. You see how he's in the way? It's actually very annoying. Reporting. Understood. There we go. I think now we got it. That person's been over here having a stroke for a very long time, and we're over here, like, having issues with the icon of itself. Well, I'm sorry, I get to you, but you know. Can't get to you. We're done? Hey, very cool, very cool. Yes, took care of it. Um, cops are over there, finally. That's been taken care of, too. Finally, the heart attack person is now safe, thank God. Um, and see. You're coming to... That one. You need to go dub people off, so you... Over here. And now we wait. Fast forward. Okay, everything's good. New call. 911, what's your emergency? Hello? There's been a car crash. <laughs> Don't sound so calm about it. Where did the collision happen? Around. Alrighty. Any injured people? Are there any injuries? No, no one's hurt. When did it happen? Yesterday evening. Sir, you don't call 911 for a car accident that happened yesterday. The car crashed and the dump is on. Sir, please contact your body shop or go to the nearest police station if you have any complaints. Okay, bye. This fucking guy. This fucking guy. Ignore that one. Oh, it happened yesterday. Well, why aren't you reporting when it actually happened, huh? What are you waiting another day later? Ah, uh, you know what? I think I'll go ahead and report it now. Like, for real. Uh, you come down here. Alright, very cool, very cool. Everything's fine? Yeah. Dude, we're on top of this. I'm actually quite surprised how well we're doing. I mean, sure, I freak out on occasion, but I'm, I'm a police operator. I'm supposed to actually... You're not supposed to freak out. You're supposed to be, like, the cool, the calm and cool collective one, but... This isn't my profession. I don't know how to handle it. I'm playing a video game simulation, and I'm freaking out just by that alone. But we got that one done. We're almost done with our day, too. I don't think we missed any single call, man. Oh. Oh, they're in that one here. Go check that one out. What is this one? Sharp tool injury. Sharp tool injury. Massive blood loss. Oh, boy. That is one mighty sharp tool, I gotta tell you. New call. 911, what's your emergency? Hi, there's an unconscious man here. He's unconscious. Um, where are you calling from? Where are you calling from? Around... Oh, could you be any further out? Uh, is he breathing? Is he breathing? Yeah, his breath smells so bad. Oh, he's drunk! <laughs> I've been there too, lady. Uh... I guess Hello? you can leave him then. Wowee, what a scumbag. Does he have any visible injuries? Wow. Okay. Um. I'll send an ambulance. I'm sending an ambulance. Okay, thanks. Alrighty. I'm not sure if that one's gonna require any sort of like um police assistance itself. But right now, let's we'll take care of the injury first, cause he's passed out. And if he gets crazy, then we'll send a little bit of backup over there. But otherwise, I think we're good. And our day is done. So now we just gotta finish up the ones that are on the map, and we're good to go. I think we answered everything. We resolved 17 cases, and we got 41 reputation, maybe 42 after that one. Yo, man, we did really amazing. All right, good job. And nobody got hurt, too, which is a great part here. On my way to the hospital. Boom! We got it done. Everything answered, I want to say, right? Let's see. So we resolved 19 cases. We ended up with one person in prison, two build, six hospitalized, um, 13 healed assisted, 44 reputation. We have to get 100 to actually pass this one. So a little bit halfway there, I would say. Uh, base income, 5,000. Rewards, ooh boy. Fines, or salaries, and our total profit is 44,000. We only got one injured team member, which was, Jesus Christ, how do I even say that? Ne ne Nefinin? Nefinin? Okay. That's way off, obviously. Uh, Lasseter was injured. How bad was his injury? 90%. Okay, a little bit injured, but not too bad. This team member is in recovery for another one day and cannot be assigned. What's actually cool about the game is that it'll work kind of like XCOM. If people are injured, um, you can't send them out. And if you do send them out, they're obviously, like, you know, not really fit for duty, so they're not as effective. And here's everything that we got. Resolve, 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 resolve. Very, very cool. And we ignored the one with the, oh, my bumper fell off. Oh, that was yesterday, like, you know, a week ago. I'm reporting it now, though. Pretty cool. All right, so let's um go to... How do I get out of here? Last duty. <laughs> duty. Let's go back or what? Let's go back. Cool. So we've done one duty in Capole. You hear that, Capole? We dutied all over your place and we did a good job doing it too. 
And we have $45,000 over here, which will kind of open up a few more people to assign. One of them's injured, so we have to pick somebody else up. And we might want to pick up a couple of bulletproof vests and stuff like that. So I'm going to take a look at the upgrades over here. And then we'll come back next episode and do another day in Capole. As I mentioned, if you guys want to see more of this going forward, let me know in the comments. Let me know by leaving a like. And if you want me to keep this around and want to see your city down the line, let me know down below as well about your city. And, you know, maybe we do a free play later on and I just pick random ones at, well, random. That makes sense, right? Random ones at random. I will catch you guys next time.